history, doesn't it? Yes. On behalf of the staff and management of Coin6, <laughs> we'd like to welcome everybody to springtime <laughs> December 2021. <laughs> we did set a record today? We, we set several records. Wow. I have a longer list now to share with all wow. of you, Ooh. not just Portland. Yeah, so we've been dealing with these unusually warm temperatures since Saturday. If you've been around the last few days, you've noticed it. But today we finally got a break from the clouds, so we added some sunshine to the mix and it truly felt like a spring day or even a fall day because these temperatures are more closely linked to October. Now, where did we go today? We got up to 63, the old record 62. That was in 1958. So another day breaking records. So look at all these temperatures here on the map. You see a lot of 60s and you see some 70s there. The Dalles reached 70 today. Central Oregon low 70s, but where we broke those records, aside from Portland, Salem 65, Troutdale 65, Vancouver 62, and in all cases, we were breaking records by at least a degree or two. So this is pretty significant, not just because we did it today on December 1st, but because at least for Portland, this is the fourth time in a matter of one week where we are seeing record temperatures for our daytime highs. Now, if you need a little reminder, our normal daytime high is 49 degrees for Portland for this time of year. Now, this is just coming off of a month where this marks the third warmest November. We're just coming out of the third warmest November since 1940 and the warmest November since 2016. So how about that rain? We had a nice amount of rain. Certainly we had a nice surplus too of over an inch for the month of November coming out with 6.83 inches, but it's not the wettest ever. It ranks 19th. So let's talk about those current conditions now. No rain for us at the moment it is 58 degrees. Yeah, it is 58 right now. Still above normal. Low 50s for us overnight. Seaside, some clouds, low line clouds starting to fill in here. 52 McMinnville still looks gorgeous. Look at that sky out there. Just lovely. If you have any pictures to share with us, please do at coin.com. There's the atmospheric river still sitting there. We're in this warm sector right here. All of this starts to change though by tomorrow. Tomorrow, more clouds in the mix, but much cooler. Low 50s in the valley and the gorge, central and eastern Oregon. We're expecting the mid 50s along the coast. Expecting highs instead of in the 50s will be in the upper 40s. How about rain? When can we see some rain? Late tonight. We're talking about probably when most of you are going to be sleeping closer to about two or three o'clock in the morning. A chance to see a quick sprinkle coming through the valley. Not amounting to much though. The big time rain that shows up for us as we get to Monday. Monday we could be adding on an additional inch or inch and a half of rain to the mix right here. Even Eastern Oregon could be tapping into about a half inch of rain during that time period. Here's your seven day forecast. So yeah, cooler trend on the way. Here's your weekend, low 50s, upper 40s, overnight temps moving into the 30s. As we roll into next week, still in the low 50s, but looking beyond Wednesday of next week, I'm seeing a much cooler trend. I think it'll be more recognizable. It'll feel more like December by then. Yeah, and that, that, I think some folks are looking forward to that, but <laughs> was kind of nice to enjoy this afternoon with the sun for December, Natasha. Sure was, yeah. yeah.